Hey everybody, um, Andy Glosick here, and I'm going to show you today how to use Discovery Education Clips and create yourself a um, iMovie trailer. Pretty neat project. So I'm going to go up here to File. I've launched iMovie on my Mac, and I apologize. This isn't the latest version. This is the um, this is the pre Mavericks one, but the new one uh, works really uh, in quite a similar fashion. So uh, when you start a project you can go with a theme or you can work down here um, on iMovie trailers. So um, let's select this one right here. Epic epic drama. Gives you a little preview of, uh, of what it's going to show you and everything. It's got the music background. Now what you're seeing here is a preview of a different, um, you know, someone else's project. Somebody at Apple created this as a preview. So um, I like that sound. I like the background. You go with that. Now another possibility is the sports one, the game. Ours is going to be pretty dramatic. But it's going to use shark footage. Okay. So here you see this. So you've got that deep dramatic uh, sound, you've got some cheers. And, and take a look at Road Trip. Just kind of. Kind of mysterious. You've got an adventure, and uh, this one, Film Noir. This is a. Let's say you're in. Uh, you know, doing a European travel video or something like that. So anyways, I think, I think I'm going to go with, um, let's go with, uh, well, let's go with the game. So, all right, so I'm going to select the game here. I'm going to call this, um, misunderstood. And so what you have, first of all here, is you have an outline. So uh, I'm going to call this um, Great Whites. Great White Misunderstanding. Okay. Uh, release date. Uh, I don't know why it popped in that, but uh, we'll just call it 2014. That's fine. Okay. Studio name, this is what uh, comes up at the beginning. So uh, your kids, if they're making these, can create their own stuff here. So I'm going to call this Mr. Losick. Mr. Losick. Use my Twitter name, Productions. And you have the different styles you can pick from. The glowing period, pyramid signals across the globe. Sun rays, clouds, spinning earth in space. Uh, let's just go black background. Like that. No, that's boring. Um, sun rays through the clouds. Yep, that's fine. All right. Now these credits and things, these things come come at the end, and you know, so you get a real Hollywood thing. That's okay. Uh, what you see here, all these names, these are from when I did uh, um, a project at the Discovery Educator Network Institute this past summer. So we'll leave that. That's fine. I'm not even really worried about that. But your kids can put all kinds of stuff in here. All right, here we go. Here's the storyboard. So it's going to show you the different um, the different clips that iMovie is going to use to put all these things together. Okay, and then you have you've got um, the um, the uh, captions or the text that comes up. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to make this trailer be about great whites and how great whites are kind of considered to be man-eaters or whatever um, but really they aren't and, and they're they're often misunderstood so for demonstration purposes we'll just put in some text here so um, we'll say um, deep deep within uh, deep within the ocean Deep within the ocean, 
I'll scroll down here. Um, there lurks one of the world's most fearsome predators. Okay. Um, feared for centuries. Deemed man eaters, man eaters. But sadly, misunderstood. Okay, no, no, go through that. All right, so what we're going to do now, so we've got all our text in here. So now what I need to do is I need to select different action shots. So this will be 1.3 seconds, that will be 7 tenths. And so so we're, we're changing very, very, very quickly all these action shots here. Okay, so in order to do that, I want to um, import um, some, some movies. And these are movies that I've downloaded from Discovery Education. So if I uh, go into my downloads, I can grab these. These are ones that I've recently downloaded. Okay, and so it's going to take uh, iMovie a little bit of time to process that. You see it coming in under the event Slumber Party. I could have, should have probably created a new event, but my daughter had uh, made a video at a slumber party at the pool. You can see some of the clips here. So that's uh, that's what's happening there. So down here, we should mix in some of these uh, slumber party clips, these underwater footages. That'd be that'd be fun. But anyways, all right. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to come here, and I'm going to just select little clips that I can uh, put in here. So maybe uh, so here's a clip of these guys tagging. So I just if I just drag this right up here, you know, it's going to be a 1.3 seconds of thrashing in the water. Right? Okay. Drag that one seven tenths. Shark coming at it. How about this one right here? Now we got nine tenths of this guy coming. I mean, this is, this is extremely, very, very, very cinematic. I mean, this is this is cool stuff we're throwing up here. Now I don't like that clip. So what I can do is I just use that, and I I'm looking for a different one. So. Let's get him right there. We'll throw it into that spot. And we'll pause right now because I've got uh, some kids coming. All right, so to speed some things up here, I went ahead and I added clips to... Um, this whole this whole project here so you just go in you just rope a clip that you want from uh, all your footage down here that you downloaded from discovery you place it into your um, your storyboard here and it's it's really quite amazing so let's take a look at this thing let's see how it turned out
All right, so you see how that project uh, turned out there. Now what I can do is I can go in here and I can I can tweak each of these clips. So if I want to get rid of one of these clips, I can just um, I can just click that and it'll remove it. And then this little action down here um, lets me actually move forward and backward in the clip to adjust where I you know what I use. So there was there was this kid right here. He was, you know, don't mind that. It's just my heater. All right. So this kid shows up here um, for a second, and it's you know, it's um, you know, it's it's okay. Um, not real happy, I guess, with the way the theme played out. And so, if this was a serious project I was doing, or if this was one of my students' projects, um, the critique I would give them was that you're kind of stuck with the theme here now, being the champion game theme. So let's see if we can't kind of tweak this project to make it where the sharks are overcoming something because you know here I end it with the word sadly misunderstood I probably should have gone a little more melancholy there and with this project what I should do is go back and tweak it to make it so that you know here this shows what what the great whites are overcoming and, and possibly even from the footage I got work in you know how researchers are, are helping them to shed the stereotype or whatever but really an amazing tool, I think, built into any Mac, this um, trailer feature, where we can take great footage. I mean, we're talking Discovery Channel footage. Um, if you have, you know, with, with the streaming stuff, you know, you may even have access to the North America series on here. And so, I mean, this is, this is some of the world's greatest, you know, scientific footage being, being shared. And you can take that and you can use it for the B-roll in your movie. So we've used uh, trailers for a different um, set of projects. Kids made book reports with them. We've had uh, kids do animal reports with, with the trailer feature. So it's uh, a way to achieve a huge leap in production without, you know, necessarily resulting with, with um, a ton of well, it results with some really great stuff, but it doesn't require a ton of skill or even time to do that. So there you go. That's all there is to it. Trailers are pretty awesome, and you can come up with some spectacular stuff. Thanks.